Windows blue screen errors are common and can be caused by both hardware and software problems. Sometimes you may experience system crash with memory management error. This error usually occurs when the system encounters issues related to memory allocation and management. The memory management process maintains and keeps a record of every memory location, whether allocated or not. However, if something goes wrong on memory allocation, it may result system crash and display such blue screen error on your computer. Problems with the memory module, outdated or incompatible device drivers, and system file corruption are common reasons for this blue screen error. Whatever the reason here are quick and effective solutions to fix the memory management error. Whenever you experience blue screen error on your computer, the first thing you need to do is disconnect all external devices including USB drives, printer or external storage devices. Disconnecting external devices such as USB drives, printers or external storage devices can help isolate memory management errors caused by faulty or incompatible peripherals. And then restart your computer. If due to this blue screen error system restarts frequently or Windows fails to boot normally, you need to boot into safe mode to bypass the error and perform further troubleshooting. Insert your Windows installation media and restart your computer. If you don't have I have shared link how to make a bootable USB drive in the description. Press any key to boot from the installation media. Click on repair your computer in the bottom left corner. Select troubleshoot then advance options. Next click on startup settings and then restart. Finally press F4 to enable safe mode F5 enables internet access on safe mode. Hence this is memory related error. Running the built-in memory diagnostic tool perform a series of tests to check your RAM for any errors and suggest possible fixes. RAM is the physical memory that your system uses to store and access data quickly. Search for memory diagnostic tool and select the first option restart now and check for problems. It performs a thorough scan of your system's RAM, identifying any issues and providing recommendations for repair or replacement. Virtual memory, also known as the paging file, serves as an extension of physical RAM, allowing your system to utilize disk space as memory when the RAM is full. Incorrectly configured virtual memory settings can lead to memory management errors, particularly if the allocated space is insufficient for system requirement. Adjusting virtual memory settings is helpful for optimizing system performance, preventing memory exhaustion, addressing memory leaks, customizing virtual memory allocation, and diagnosing memory issue. Open virtual memory settings and uncheck the box that says automatically manage paging file size for all drives. Select your system drive, usually C, and click on custom size. Enter a value that is 1.5 times your total RAM in both the initial size and maximum size boxes. Another common cause for memory management error is outdated or incompatible drivers. Device drivers enable communication between your hardware components and the operating system. If they are not updated or compatible, they can cause conflicts and errors. Updating your drivers ensures compatibility with the latest software and can resolve issues related to memory management. While Device Manager is a convenient built-in tool for updating drivers, you can also consider using third-party driver update software for a more comprehensive scan and update process. Also, you can visit the device manufacturer's website to download and install the latest available driver for your system. Still memory management error occurring? It may be because important system files are damaged or corrupted due to power interruption, disk error or malware infection. Run System File Checker SFC, and Deployment Image Servicing and Management DISM, tools to scan and repair corrupted system file. To run the System File Checker utility open the command prompt as administrator, type command SFC slash scan now then press the enter key to scan and repair corrupted system files. Let the scanning complete 100%. It may take some time depending on your system's health. If system file checker fails to repair corrupt files, we recommend run DISM command to perform advanced scan and repair Windows system image. Once the scanning complete, restart computer and check the memory management error status. Outdated versions of Windows 10 or system files can cause unexpected errors. Checking for and installing pending updates is another quick and easy way to figure out if that is causing blue screen error. Open settings and navigate Windows Update. 
Hit check for updates to download and install pending Windows updates. You need to restart Windows to apply the changes and check if no more BSOD error occurs. Sometimes virus or malware infection is the reason why Windows crashes frequently or getting this blue screen error. Perform a full system scan with Windows security or third-party antivirus to remove any malware infection that might trigger this error. Boot time scans run before Windows fully loads, making it easier to detect and remove malware that may be actively interfering with memory management processes. Sometimes, overheating can cause hardware components to malfunction, including the RAM modules responsible for memory management. By ensuring proper airflow and cooling within your computer case, you can prevent overheating and minimize the risk of memory-related errors. Also, if you've overclocked your hardware components, revert them to their default settings in the BIOS or UEFI firmware to reduce the risk of instability and memory management errors. Hope these tips help fix memory management error on Windows PC. Don't forget to share your feedback in the comments below. Thank you.